High Point woman remains in critical condition after being shot in the head over the weekend. This man, who's accused of shooting her, bonded out of jail. WFMY News News Amber Lake shares new details after talking to her family and neighbors. Like you said, I spoke with, fam with a family friend and family members today off camera. It's a tough time for them as their loved one fights for her life in the hospital. The family friend told me that she was there today just trying to straighten up the victim's home for the family. Police received a suicide call around 545 Saturday morning to Everett Lane. When they arrived, they found a 27-year-old woman with a gunshot wound to her head. Neighbors say they woke up early to police officers knocking on their door. What's going on? You, you don't know. You just, I, I just saw the police officer. That was like the whole line. And I was like, what's wrong? What happened? An investigation started. Based on what was found on scene, police arrested this man, 44-year-old Trinarda Burns. One neighbor says she's shaken up by everything. We're staying here, but I mean, it's not secure anymore. It's just like, what happened if something happened to us or my kids or I don't know. Police say Burns and the victim knew each other. Investigators charged him with assault with a deadly weapon with intent to kill, inflicting serious injury. Neighbors say this is just proof that you never really know who lives in your neighborhood. You never know what kind of people they are. So they can show us one face. I can show my face like that or whatever, but I don't know exactly what's going on in, inside of the house. Court documents show that Burns has a long criminal history. He was released from jail on this charge after paying a $250,000 secured bond. His next court date is in July.